I wanted to do a rat rod semi truck. It's definitely everything that I could have wanted and more. Peterbilt trucks come in all shapes and sizes. But have you ever seen one quite like this? Raw, massive, and unique. There's just nothing else out there like it. It draws attention wherever it goes and, and it makes people smile. I'm Jim Muncy, and this is Overkill. It is totally, completely unique. There's nothing else out there like it. Unique indeed. Jim took a 359 Peterbilt and set about creating this awe-inspiring beast of a machine. I had this vision of a rat rod semi truck. I had an old semi just in 2015. I kind of outlined what I had in mind. It evolved more into a hot rod. The majority of the work was done within five months. I just looked at it one day and said, this thing's overkill. I look at this thing and to me, it's a rolling piece of art. With the raw steel frame, the leather, and the wood interior. So the main frame is just done with two inch mild steel pipe. It just gives the whole truck a nice beefy industrial look. We just put a lot of different materials that wouldn't necessarily normally go together and incorporate it into a really cool hot rod. I've been a gearhead ever since I was 15 years old. I just love fast cars and trucks. It's a blast to drive. I mean, just looking out over that big, massive engine and that long hood is just, uh, it's just cool, it's fun. And while this vehicle may have changed beyond recognition, it still retains the original engine. It's an 855 cubic inch Cummins Big Cam 3. This is our air intake. It was made out of two top fuel dragster hats. We also have triangulated four-link suspension and airbags to control the ride height and ride quality. Performance-wise, right now we're putting out about 450 horse, 1,400 foot-pounds of torque with the 306 gear and the direct drive Allison automatic transmission. It's good to about 100 mile an hour before it hits the upper ranges of the RPMs. And it's also good for burnouts. <laughs> Makes a little smoke, doesn't it? The lug nut covers were made from billet aluminum. They were machined for us by a high school shop class and they just turned out absolutely beautiful. The wing is just for fun. It has no purpose other than to look cool. I really don't have any problems finding a parking spot or, or turning it around. It, it's really got a very sharp turning radius. And of course, this rig turns a few heads when it's out and about. The best thing about driving overkill is just, just the reactions of people. That's what it's all about. It's just fun. It makes people smile. They've never seen anything like it before, so everybody's into it. And it's just a unique, wild vehicle. I built one motorcycle and I've always wanted to build something else, but this is way beyond anything I could ever dream of. This is so cool. It's awesome, you don't see anything like this ever, really. Super singles, open wheel, and the four link on airbags. I mean, it's got everything. Everything you could ever ask for in a, in a rat rod. You can't be in a hurry if you're going to take it somewhere. It's going to get a crowd of people around it wanting to take pictures. <laughs> I wanted to do a rat rod semi truck. And it's definitely everything that I could have wanted and more. <laughs> 